Hi, I'm Pastor Mark. Have you ever heard of the rubber band principle? It's simply this. Rubber bands must be stretched in order to be effective. And so do we. Anyone who's ever achieved anything of note has been stretched while seeking to accomplish it. One of the most common mistakes is thinking that success in life is due to some sort of talent or genius or special spark that others have, but that you do not. Get rid of that kind of thinking. Success comes when you stretch out of your comfort zone to meet the challenges head on. Now the stretch makes you vulnerable. After all, it's true that when a rubber band is tight, that's when it may break. That is why you need to bathe your actions in prayer and be surrounded by those who love you and can advise you well. But it's worth it. Will you have critics? Of course. Jesus had them. He said in John 15, and if they persecuted me, they will persecute you also. So expect that, but stretch anyway. Dr. Jonas Salk, who invented the polio vaccine, faced harsh criticism for his pioneering work. He said that the criticism always came in three stages. First, they say that what you're doing is not important. Secondly, they say that it will never work. And when it does work, they say, we knew you could do it all along. Just remember the rubber band principle when you feel things that you are facing are starting to stretch you. It's right there that you can do your best work. Well, that's all for today. God bless you, and I'll see you in church on Sunday.